Hey, what's up guys? Pokesum here. In this video, I have the Pokemon Center version of the Coridon Elite Trainer Box. Uh, I believe the only difference between it and a regular one is it comes with uh, not only the uh, promo, but a promo with Pokemon Center logo on it as well. Uh, and I guess two extra packs. Um, I, I think... I think all of the ETBs are going to come with nine packs now instead of eight. I think. <laughs> so, yeah. I think that's the only difference. Two extra packs and... Um, and the extra promo. Uh, we'll get the little book out here since we haven't flipped through it yet. It's going to be basically the same as the old ones, I would think, yeah. And it'll have the set list in the back. Let's see. Of course, if you saw my booster box opening, you know I pulled that one, which is the one I wanted most. So, uh, yeah, we're going to be looking for the Maridon special illustration or the Coridon or the Gardevoir. Great Tusk is okay, too. The Iron Treads is kind of not that great of a special illustration card, in my opinion. Uh, or Penny. That'd be nice. And, of course, the gold cards. Would be nice as well. How many gold cards are there? Six? Yeah. So six gold cards. And... Um, seven, ten special illustration cards? Yeah. And the hyper rares, which were formerly known as full arts. How many of those are there? Two, eleven, twenty... 20? Yeah, that's what it looks like. Of course, two of them are like that, which are pretty cool. Okay, well, let's get into it. I don't want to spend too much time going through everything. All right, let's uh, see. Is that 11 packs? Yeah, okay, yeah, it's 11 packs. Okay, here's, here's the sleeves. Code card. Okay, yeah, it does have two promos in it and a pack pack of energy and the dividers, which are pretty cool. Oh, and my dice just came out. Oh, and they're putting those in there now. Okay, well, that's something. Oh, I'm going to have die everywhere. <laughs> wow, wow. Woo, wow. Maybe for the Maridon. Oh, yeah. I also got the Maridon. And uh, I thought... I don't know if you guys knew about the promotion where if you pre-ordered these from PokemonCenter.com, you were supposed to get a promo, a LeChonk stamped, from, uh, stamped with the Pokemon Center. Uh, yeah, I didn't get any, and I contacted them, and... At first, they didn't know anything about it. Then when I sent them the screenshot, they are like, oh, yeah, well, you had to buy four products just to get one. And I thought, and I said, well, I thought that you got one for each of the four products that you pre-ordered. Like, I was expecting to get two LeChonks. Anyway. And I got none. So I don't know if any of you guys were aware of that or not, but my God. Okay, yeah, that's about how it goes. Here we go. So, yeah. There's the regular promo. Scarlet Violet 14 and the one with the Pokemon Center logo. That's the only difference in the two. It is a cool looking card, though. <clears throat> Alright, let's just get into it. How about that? I'll sleeve those up later since we're five minutes into the video. <laughs> 
All righty, let's see if we can get anything good. We, uh, I did really good with my booster box. Um, <coughs> let's see if we can do as well with these. Experience share, Stonjourner, Penny, a reverse Capsa Kid. I'd already forgotten that we get two reverses. A reverse Houndoom and an Indeedy. Yes, indeedy. All right, moving on to the second pack. Steel Energy. Poniard, Wiglet, Toad School, Sandal. Mavo Stiff, Miriam, Spiritomb, a reverse Squawkabilly, Riolu, and a Gyarados EX full art terrestrialized. Oh, that's nice. Very nice. And it is one of the better cards to pull. These are called, I believe, uh, ultra rares now. Is the technical, official name. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Let me get that sleeved up. So, yeah, very nice. We did very well. Oh, also, I don't know if you guys have been keeping up with the prices, but they have dropped quickly. The best time, if you're buying individual cards, the best time to buy it is about the first week or two after release because that's when the market is going to be flooded and the prices are always, 100% of the time, going to go down. We got a good pull, so there you go. Have a code. Um, but yeah, do not pre-order individual cards before the set releases. Because that Miriam was, at one time, a $230 card. And it's already gone down to $80. So, do not. I, I, and I just, I don't understand why people don't realize that. Like, I don't understand how cards sell for way much more than they should before a set releases. I don't know. It's like... The, the, you would think that the people that buy individual cards would be familiar enough with the market <laughs> to know that they should not buy a card before a set releases. That is just ignorant. I mean, but hey, I don't know. I don't know why people don't realize that. Rotom, Chansey, and a Toxicroak EX. Which we did pull out of our booster box. But... Still, uh, I mean, it's a almost an, it's an ultra rare. It's a double rare. There we go. That's the technical term for it. All right. We have darkness, everyone. Darkness. Houndoom, Fido, Scatterbug, Drifloon, Ultra Ball, Espathra, Arvin, Energy Retrieval, Tandem Mouse, and a Revavroom. I wonder, are there two different code cards now? You know, late in the X and Y era, they started, um, they made two different code cards to where people couldn't weigh them. I wonder with the double, with the two different reverses and a hollow or better in every pack, I bet there's only one kind of code card now. Let me look at the backs of them. Yeah, the back of them all look the same to me. So, yes. Only one code card now, but they don't have to worry about the packs being weighed, I would think. Now Doom Fido, Scatterbug, Drifloon. Didn't I just get that order? Toad Scroll, Mouse Hold, Vitality Band, Potion, Fue Coco, and a Klefki. But yeah, that would be interesting. I wonder if the Hollows way less than some of the other cards might. I don't know. Water Energy. Sprigatito. Flittle. Saviipa. Found our Cacturn. Mesagoza. Driftblim. Metatite. Cyclozar. And a King Gambit. Oh, 
Let's see. What shall we get now? Grass energy. Sprigatito. Flittle. It's a viper. Hound hour. Didn't we just have that? Okay, I'm not going back. Uh, toxicity. Crocolore. Muck. Lechonk. Oh, wow. There's a nest ball. Secret rare nest ball. That would be really, really cool. But I pulled that out of my... Uh, and a houndstone. I pulled it out of my um, booster box. But it is still a $20 card. It is still one of the better cards to pull from the set. So, so hey, I can't really argue with it. This has been another good ETB. Well, not another good one. Another good opening for Scarlet and Violet. Um, yeah. All right. Let's see. We have Darkness, everyone. Darkness. It's the Brothers Darkness. So, Toddle, Magikarp, Magnemite, Energy Switch, Defiance, Band, Tatsugiri, Nest Ball, Ralts. Hey, there's the special, or the uh, illustration rare of Curlia, which is one of the better, I think it's like the second best um, special illustration you can get. Very nice. Special illustration, Curlia, Anical Ride on Hollow. Just when I was about to say, we didn't have any illustration rares yet. We pulled a good one. All right. And we still have three packs left. What can we get? Can we get anything? Probably. In all likelihood, yes. What does the Magic 8 Ball say? All signs point to yes. Psychic Energy. Satotl, Magikarp, Magnemite Energy Switch. Yeah, we just had that order. Florgis, Greedent, Vivion, Floatzel, Houndstone, which is a reverse rare, and a Maridon. I believe this is the first reverse rare we've gotten. I'll sleeve it up. I think, I don't know that reverse rares are harder to get or not, but... I pulled six out of my booster box, six out of 36 packs. So, here we go. We have Fighting Energy, Varum, Clauncher, Skiddo, Mark, uh, Quaxley, Pecherisu, Picnic Basket, Bombardier, Reverse Magneton, Pawneard, and a Howlucha. All right, last pack. Can we get some last... Pack magic. Let's see. We have Metal Energy, Varum, Clauncher, Skidaho, Quaxley, same one, yeah. Daxbun, Torkoal, Scovillain, Reverse Flittle, Reverse Espathra, and an Arboliva. So we didn't get any more pulls. The Magic 8 Ball was incorrect. So we got a Reverse Rare. And we got the Toxicroak. We got the Illustration Rare of the Curlia. The Terastalized Geared OCX Full Art Ultra Rare. And the Hyper Rare slash Gold Card, whatever you want to call it, Nest Ball. So pretty good again. Pretty good. 11 packs. Can't complain. I will say, it seems like it's a little... I didn't think it would be as hard to get the Illustration Rares, the regular Illustration Rares, as it is. Uh, so that's now 47 packs have opened and I've only pulled four. Uh, but I've pulled plenty of other good stuff, so I'm not complaining. I just thought, you know, I thought they would be at least one every nine packs, if not one every six. But anyway, looks like they're more like, they're more around one per 12. All right, well, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, do all that if you want to. I still have the Maridon box on the way. Well, it's here, but... I have the opening on the way. <laughs> All right. Be excellent to yourselves, dudes. Have a good one.